Hi, I'm Lisa Pressman. I'm here to tell you about myself and also about my classes. I actually went to undergraduate school for pottery and when I came out of undergraduate, I was making sculpture. And then when I applied to graduate school, I applied as a sculptor, but I came out of graduate school as a painter. So I'm really a material girl. Um, what happened in graduate school is I got introduced to oil paint and wax and I was mixing this wax stuff in with my oil paint and it made it really um, textural and translucent and I just loved it. Right now, these days, it's called cold wax, but in the 80s, we just called it wax and we used it as a medium. And I've been, I've been using that all, all since that time. The other thing that I uh, discovered about 17 years ago was encaustic. And encaustic was interesting because it took me on a little side trip where I only made encaustic paintings for about five years. I had to figure out how encaustic was gonna work for me. I, I tell students that it takes five years to really get it in terms of using encaustic. And then I got sick of encaustic and said, hey, you know what, I wanna go back and I wanna paint with oil paint and wax. And so I do both practices right now, depending on the project, how I feel, the weather. I also have a drawing practice that I do. And also occasionally you'll catch me making sculpture and things like that, revisiting the past. Um, my work has shown internationally and nationally, and I have three galleries that represent me. As far as classes go, my interest in, in my students are is basically in helping you find your personal language. I'm interested in what makes you tick and how we can figure out what you want to express. We do that through prompts and exercises, sometimes some writing and definitely a lot of talking and a lot of making. One of the things I make sure that we cover is fundamentals of art and design, whether you're a seasoned uh, professional artist or, or not, it doesn't matter. I find that revisiting the fundamentals always is a good thing to do. I am also very um, interested and I'm excited to show historical references and contemporary artists to, to you, to the class. I think it helps put your work into context and it also gives new ideas and new ways to approach the work. As far as teaching goes, I am intuitive. I am improvise, I improvise and I am, a, I love to paint. And so I like to have some fun too. I look forward to meeting you in my class. Thank you.